Do you need to convert your combine harvester between rapeseed and cereals, but this takes too long? With the new T-Series from John Deere and the new 600X cutting system, this can now be done in less than five minutes. After arriving at the edge of the field and disconnecting the header trolley, you release the central locking system. Back in the cab, you can open the grain tank by pressing a button. After you have lifted off the header, you only need to connect it via the central multi-coupler for hydraulic, electrical and mechanical locks and connect the drive shaft to the combine harvester. The 600X cutting system can be fully converted in less than three minutes by one person to harvest a new crop type. Simply release the rapeseed side knives with the quick-release connections and replace them with the dividers. Back to the combine harvester. For improved threshing in difficult conditions in barley or certain varieties of wheat, for example, it is often enough to move the intensive friction bar into position. Usually, the use of de-awning plates is not necessary, which means the threshing output is increased. For sensitive crops such as rapeseed or legumes, the booster bar can be quickly and easily swiveled out of position again thanks to the new design. If you now climb into the cabin, first enter on the display the crop height and desired stubble height. The combine will automatically set the appropriate table knife position for optimum harvesting results. After that, you only need to change the setting to the required crop type, and all the other basic settings of the combine harvester, such as the drum rotation speed, sieves and wind speed, will be automatically set. Job done. You can't do this any easier, faster or more accurately.
The special design of this single rotor combine is what makes the S-Series so unique. It gives you clear advantages over other, more traditional rotor concepts or hybrid designs. The John Deere concept ensures a smooth transition from a tangential crop flow in the feeder house to an axial crop flow in the rotor. More space in the front of the rotor makes this transition easier and less power consuming. The feeding drum is actively moving material into the rotor where it is divided into three equal streams for balanced loading 270 degrees around the rotor. This maximizes the capacity of the rotor as it prevents uneven crop flow and works well even under wet and green small grain harvesting conditions. John Deere's active concave isolation maintains a consistent concave clearance, again enabling up to 5% better loss performance in large crop yields and green conditions. You can run the concave wider for more crop-on-crop -crop threshing. The concave position is adopted to the crop flow by the active concave isolation, resulting in a 10% higher throughput. The big diameter of the rotor ensures gentle threshing and good straw quality. The thickness of the straw mat is reduced over the conical threshing area. In the front area, the grain that is easiest to thresh is removed through gentle and efficient crop-on-crop -crop threshing. In the rear part of the cone, the remaining crop is separated. The overall effect is very gentle threshing for the best possible grain and straw quality, as well as the highest power efficiency. On the variable stream rotor, the crop flow can be slowed down or sped up from within the cab. In the standard position, the crop makes seven full rotations for higher separation of grain. If the operator wants to improve straw quality or reduce chaff load on the cleaning shoe in brittle conditions, he can switch to the advanced position, in which the straw exits the rotor after only five rotations. The discharge beta ensures a smooth and even feeding of the material into the chopper and a very good distribution of chopped material on the ground under green and dry conditions. The new S-Series gentle and efficient threshing and excellent performance for perfect grain and straw quality at any time. Over the last few years, the new S-Series has been constantly updated to achieve even higher capacity levels. In order to cope with the increased output, John Deere has designed a new cleaning shoe to handle the higher material throughput from the rotor. The new Dynaflow Plus cleaning system offers a 12% larger sieve area compared to the previous cleaning shoe. It features one of the largest cleaning shoe areas on the market. It also uses an innovative aluminium frame design. The stress on the material is reduced despite the larger surface area. This not only increases reliability, but also helps to keep down the overall weight of the machine. A completely new fan system provides 57% more airflow, which is balanced over the entire sieve area. At the same time, this cleaning system is very easy to optimize. Our tests have shown that, for example, an incorrect setting of the fan speed will have very little influence on grain losses and tailings. This means less errors and an easy adjustment of the machine by the operator. The active handling of the grain by augers ensures uniform feeding of the cleaning shoe, even in sticky crop conditions or side slopes. Dividers on the upper chaffer prevent the crop from accumulating on one side. This offers the highest cleaning performance on slopes of up to 7%. On sloping gradients of more than 7%, the active Hillmaster slope compensation system is essential. It keeps the threshing system perfectly leveled to ensure maximum performance in hilly conditions of up to 22%. The Active Tailings Return System ensures top grain quality and performance. An elevator with rubber paddles lifts the material up to avoid piling material being processed multiple times. A small threshing drum then gently separates remaining kernels. The material is further distributed by an auger on top of the chaffer. To avoid punctual overload of the cleaning system, the opening at the bottom of the auger is in a triangle shape, so material is spread evenly over the whole width of the cleaning shoe. This ensures superior grain quality at a low loss level. 
The new Dynaflow Plus cleaning shoe. Large, light and less sensitive. For top grain quality.